morning. Some coffee for you. <laughs> Trying to wake up today. How are you doing today? <sighs> That's fair. Well, whether you're just getting up or whether you've been up for a while, please make sure you get up at some point. You stretch a little bit. Eat something if you're able to. Drink some water. Take your meds if that applies to you. And I hope that you remember that you are loved. You matter. It's okay if your brain is not braining properly or if it seems like you can't do the things you normally should be able to do well. It's okay. I love you anyway. All right, friends. Get out there and make a difference. Oh my gosh. You ever wake up in the morning and you're just like, you just can tell you're going to be so cringe all day? Yeah. Anyway, so today's my self-care, health care day. And I normally go out for second breakfast and I normally, you know, buy myself lunch, go out for lunch <coughs> and all that stuff to make the day a vibe and all that. And I, I still love that, but it's not very cost effective. So I'm wondering if there's a way to, you know, I'll still go get coffee, but for my food, I don't know. I wonder if there's a way I could still make it a vibe, still make it not complicated, but save a little bit of money at the same time. So I'm thinking of trying to go to the grocery store and see if I can find some stuff I could just pick up. It's a lot cheaper than going to order food. Yeah, so let's see if we can still make today a vibe, but save money. I'm not gonna lie, the second mug is always for me. As soon as I turn the camera off, I just drink it. I'm gonna go to the grocery store and see if I can find some ideas for second breakfast and lunch. And then we'll head on to our first appointment. Well, that worked out really well. Oh my gosh, my skin is so shiny. Anyway, I was able to get some stuff for second breakfast and for lunch and some apple juice for like 10 bucks. So, it's not bad. First appointment went well. It's always like initial soreness after physical therapy, but ultimately it has really been beneficial for my neck or cervical spine and my lower back uh, lumbar region. All right, time for second breakfast. So this is my friend, George McClellan. Um, I don't know why, but I love this spot. I don't even know what kind of person he was. He could have been the most horrible person in the world. But for some reason, his gravesite is one of the most calming places in the world. So we're gonna sit here and enjoy second breakfast.
second breakfast at the graveyard, I think I could definitely say that was a whole vibe. And I think we're going to do that again. I think we're going to do that again. That was fun. All right, time for my next appointment. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> second appointment done and it's a bit early for lunch so I was thinking we'd go to the bookstore for a little bit this looks amazing and will be going on my TBR pile. I highly recommend this one. This was an excellent book. A student recommended this one to me. All the world will be your enemy, prince with a thousand enemies, and whenever they catch you, they will kill you. But first they must catch you, digger, listener, runner, prince with a swift warning. Be cunning and full of tricks, and your people shall never be destroyed. really enjoying the self-compassion workbook I'm getting a lot out of it and it's kind of something I'm doing in conjunction with my therapy like I do that's kind of my homework and then I bring it into my therapist we talk about it and then I work on the next chapter anyway all right time for the last appointment of the day yay
say that today's experiment in um, bringing my own food was a com <laughs> was a complete success. Um, you know, it is really important for me to find ways to make my self-care appointment day a vibe, especially when I have multiple appointments and I'm focusing on my physical and mental health, making sure that I eat as I go throughout the day and don't have to worry about what to eat and when is really important. But I think it was good to show myself that I could do all of this for less than $15. I was able to, you know, get food and have a wonderful second breakfast and tea at the graveyard, a wonderful lunch by the water, and you know, and then one stop for coffee, and it was it was good. It was a whole vibe. It was great. This is definitely a longer vlog than I normally do. Uh, let me know what you think about having a longer format where I'm showing me going to my appointments as well as the in-between parts of my day, but it was also kind of fun bringing you guys with me for the whole day. Yeah, so I'm going to finish up my walk and head home. And yeah, I guess that's it. It's time for your next adventure. I'll miss you. Love you guys.